Right now they're looking for someone to head the team that is work, that's going to work directly with the permanent secretary uh, in, in, the, in Bahamas that has responsibility for disaster management, more of a technical advisor. So they've reached out to, to me, um, looking at my availability, or if I could identify a suitable person. One that person to identify, um, that person will be deployed before the end of this week. This comment came after the Hindu Dharmic Sabha handed over $200,000 to the Civil Defense Commission to aid in the relief effort. The CDC is also prepared to send a volunteer and staff to support the CARICOM Operation Support Team that will be working on the ground in the Bahamas. Craig said the Guyana Defense Force will also play a part to support the country and the Commission will continue to monitor the situation on the ground to determine how Guyana can play its role in the global mission. In relation to the Guyanese family that returned home, the DG offered an update. We were living with them before they moved to Bahamas about seven years ago. Uh, we are in contact with their family. Uh, so we have uh, made arrangements for Trans Guyana. Um, they're providing flight free of cost to take back the entire family to let them. And then they will meet with their, their relatives and then we will be continue, we'll be keeping in contact with them. Shikil Bourne. Fine for her.